If you popped a tube and you need to fix the flat, or you need to do some maintenance on your bike, the first thing to do is remove the rear wheel. Put your bike in a repair stand and shift the chain to the smallest cog to help the wheel slide out more easily. If you're in the middle of your ride or you don't have a bike stand, you can flip the bike upside down to work on it. If your derailleur has a clutch that increases tension on the chain, turn it off. Next, loosen the lever on the axle and spin it counterclockwise until all the threads are completely loose. Support the wheel and pull the axle out. To get the wheel out smoothly, pull down on the tensioning arm and back on the body of the derailleur. The wheel should slide right out. When you're done with your work and it's time to reinstall the wheel, add a thin film of grease to the threads on the axle. Get the derailleur out of the way by pulling it down and back. It also helps to make sure one of the smallest cogs bumps up against the upper section of chain. Check that the wheel is fully seated in the dropouts before reinstalling the axle. If the axle doesn't slide in smoothly on the first try, remove it and check the wheel's alignment before trying again. Screw in the axle and close the lever. Make sure it's tucked out of the way and isn't touching the bike's frame. If the lever closes too easily and is touching the frame, it's probably not tight enough. Open the lever and tighten the axle before trying again. Turn the clutch back on if you have one and finish by spinning the pedals and making sure that the gears shift normally. To recap, shift the chain to the smallest cog and turn off the clutch to make it easier to remove the wheel. Support the wheel as you loosen and remove the axle. Move the derailleur down and back to let the wheel out and do the same to let it back in. Reinstall the axle and turn the clutch back on and make sure the gears shift normally.